God is good. But some are so quick to say, how can God be good when murder, cancer, and birth defects exist? How could God be good when political corruption, racial tension, and suicide bombers are all regularly reported? So many so quickly point to all the wrong in the world as their evidence to God's negligence, screaming, if God were good, this world would reveal it. We would experience it. But I say, we do. You just need to open your eyes to see it, to take a moment and consider it. If God were not good, everyone would be a murderer. We'd all have cancer. No baby would be born healthy. If God were not good, we wouldn't know times of peace. Laws wouldn't exist. Unity would be an impossibility. If God were not good, sunrises and smiles, joy and laughter, generosity and beauty wouldn't be a part of our reality. To those who shake their fists at God, did you forget that this world and every human in it is cursed by sin? Have you forgotten that in sin we are enemies of God? He owes us nothing. No good is due us, but as evidence of God's magnificent love, mercy, grace, and goodness, Jesus was sent to us to die for us so that we, enemies of God, can be reconciled to God. To those who hold the opinion that God is not good, the truth is, no matter how strongly stated or how widely accepted opinions of God, will not and cannot change the truth of God. God is good. The immature looks at the world and despairs, but the mature looks at the very same thing and is able to declare that the Lord is upright. He is my rock and there is no unrighteousness in him. God is good. And that's today's Bible Munch.